All right, so you know what time it is, right? It's time to find some love, okay? You can't be single forever. When it comes to dating, everyone has a laundry list of what they want. He must be tall. She must be fit, right? Ball up the list and throw all those must-haves away. Here to talk about turning deal breakers into deal makers in 2016 is Gina Gideon with Just Lunch Cleveland. Thank you so much for being here. You're very welcome. Thank you for having me. You know, we kind of talked about this. I want to show people this. This was a report done by Wallet Hub saying that, you know, Cleveland's not the best place for singles, saying that there's low online dating opportunities, high percentage of singles here, the cafes, restaurants, movies. They looked at all of that and said that this just is, I think, 118 out of 150. That's correct. That How do you correct. change that? How do you turn that around? Well, the reason it is the way that it is is because we actually have a very low percentage of singles that want to do an online dating experience versus the high percentage of singles in the area. So um, we're number three on the list for a number of singles, which is good for the single folks out there. I know a lot of people, they say, you know, I want this in a man, I want this in a woman, she must look this way. Uh, what are the top three deal makers for people out there? Deal makers, I like to call these the ABCs. So number one, appearance, take pride in your appearance. You need to, you know, really just, nobody wants somebody that's disheveled and so just really take pride in your appearance and be active. Um, B would be uh, being uh, Stylish, well balanced, probably, yeah. well balanced mm -hmm. in, um, in your lifestyle. Nobody wants a workaholic. They want somebody that can maintain work. Yes, be hardworking, but yet still have a good balance between um, work and their social life. Um, and then lastly, we also want to um, focus in on confidence. C, confidence. Confidence sells. Uh, you definitely want to always maintain confidence in everything that you do. Um, bonus, good sense of humor. Can't yeah. go wrong there. How do singles uh, make sure that, I guess, that they're not making the same mistakes? Because a lot of times you go to the same places, you hang out with the same people. How are you going to meet someone new? Well, number one, throw away your deal breaker list. Get rid of it. Scratch it, be done. So you need to get rid of that list. Um, you also need to just be out of your comfort zone. If you're visiting the same bars, the same restaurants, the same coffee shops, you haven't met that right person for you, you're not going to. Change it up, switch it up, do something different. Don't be afraid to, to try something new. So I guess, you know, if you want someone that's six feet tall or if he wants someone that has blonde hair, don't look at it that way anymore. Kind of change maybe visually what you like. Is that part of this? I agree. Yes, I agree. I actually, I mean, for example, I have a client of mine too. Well, they're married now, but um, Jane came to me and she said she really wanted a man that was six feet tall who has a master's degree and has to have dark hair. Well, I fixed her up with a gentleman that has blonde hair. He's 5'9". She fell in love. They have babies. They're married. They're having a great time. She threw away the deal breaker list and it, it worked out for her. So she's not, you know, she, she realizes people are people. We're not manufacturing them in the back room. Okay, well, thank you so much You're for being welcome. with us. You're welcome. We'll be right you. back.